talking about health at the moment too, I've just been told to actually advise you, what, uh, one of you or both of you could actually be having a tough time coming up. It's not you personally, but I just feel like someone's been diagnosed with cancer and I feel like cancer's a natural picture, okay? What, can you relate? Yes. It's not you though? No, okay, good. It's, uh, how long ago is this? I feel like it's recent. Sorry, my heart's racing. Yeah, it's all right. I found out Thursday night. Mine. Yeah, it's not a good cancer right now. I'm just going to say that's good. going to become quite aggressive if I may say so. And you know this as well, and this is probably why you're out skipping a bit. You know, when I read, ladies and gentlemen, if some of you have heard me on radio or even when you come to see me in person, I'm not here to blow wind up anyone's ass. I'm here to receive the messages and just relay that to you straight away. And that's that's how I bring guidance and reassurance into people's lives. So they're actually aware of what's coming up in their lives. And, you know, when we all leave here tonight, it's still up to you to take control of your life, and it's still up to you how you actually go through that. But uh, one of the big things I get straight away is this cancer isn't going to be good and even even I'm seeing a bit of upset coming from you now a bit of sadness that really resonates with me and I just feel like we're going to be going through something early next year or the end of this year it's going to become quite aggressive as well is this a female friend it's my aunt who's like my mom yeah okay